Hi YouTubers and welcome to my channel. The purpose of today's video will be to show you how to install Docker on every Linux environment. For this I will use uh, one virtual machine which I will prepare right now using the grant. So let's begin with the process. First I will prepare the virtual machine. If you don't know how to do it with the grant, I have a video which will appear somewhere here from where we, you can take this information. I'll do it right now for the demo. And uh, I will fast forward this process. Okay, we have the virtual machine right now. So let's close this and see what we have here. In VirtualBox, I have one virtual machine with CentOS and four gigs of RAM and two processors. Okay. Okay. I'll connect to the machine using PuTTY because it's more comfortable. So the IP address of the machine is 192.168.56.111. Yes. And the login credentials are a grant. And again, the grant. Okay, we are in the machine right now. And let's begin with the installation of the Docker. Uh, why I'm using this process is because with this procedure, we have every time the latest version, and regardless of the distribution you are using. It just download the docker and install the latest version. So, okay, let's continue. First, I'm going here. Get docker.com and just copy this line and paste it to the shell. Let's check the file. Okay. It's here. Let's now make it executable. So sudo chmod plus x get docker dot sh. Enter. I was out minus out here. Okay, the file now is executable, and let let's execute it. And this will install Docker on our virtual machine, so it will take a while. Be patient. As I said, I'm not using the built-in package managers because many of them have obsolete repositories which contains Docker but it is not the latest version. Here with this procedure you can be sure that this is the latest one. So this is the reason that I don't use yum or apt. Okay. Now we have docker installed. Let's check the version. Docker sudo docker dash dash version. Okay, we have the latest one. Now the next step is to update our Yum package manager 
which contains uh, many dependencies for Docker to work in properly. And let's do it right now. For Sent uh, OS, it's Yum, but uh, if you have Debian distribution, maybe you should use apt or similar. Okay. Let's continue here. So sudo yum update and this will update all the packages on the system. Okay, the update is completed. Now The next step is to run the docker daemon file. So sudo systemctl start docker here status to check it. We have it up and running and to take the things to its end let's uh, run one container with uh, hello world up so sudo docker run dash d dash p eighty 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 and this container which will present one line in the browser you will see it okay so let's check that the container is running docker yes uh, yes of course you have to using sudo Yes, we have the container. So let's check it in the browser. The IP address of the virtual machine is 192.111.168.56.101, as you know. And uh, port 80. This is the result. So we have our docker up and running thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe like and share with friends this will support me to do more videos like this